just for uh, show. Um, this is also sort of a let's look at, in a way. I've never done one. Oh, here's an enemy. Just wait. So that right there, what I just did, is a charge attack. Uh, you would have to hold down the melee button, which is uh, its own different weapon to do it. This probably would have been better if we started this in the menu. I'm trying to level up my pistol, because I don't have uh, that much on it. What? I don't know. Okay, well let me just explain something first. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm losing health. My shields went down. Okay. Okay, let me uh, explain. Um, so, this game is right now in a closed beta. Oh, there's another person. Um, this game is completely about co-op, practically. So, it's a complete co-op game. There is no, like, versus, you can't go kill each other, etc, etc. Uh, but again, this is beta, so they might implement that later. Um, so, uh, the only way you can really get access to this is by paying money or getting a free beta key. Um, right now, I know on this one website, there's uh, 3,000 or so free beta keys. And I'll put a link in the description for that. Um, oh, oh shit. Yeah, never mind. Um, so, as you can see in the top right, uh, you see those uh, one, two, three. Those are abilities. So, if I press one, uh, I use my ability. And uh, so, that would be my first ability. My second one, it blinds every sight. Uh, and my third one, high jump. Uh, I also would get a fourth one later, um, but there's a tech tree of upgrading. Um, which you will see later. Um, so yeah, people, uh, right, you can play solo. Uh, you can play privately so only your f people and your contacts can join. Um, or you can uh, play uh, like just freely open. Uh, this is a mod for a pistol right here. Uh, I'll talk about that later. Uh, yeah. You can do uh, cool tricks and stuff. Uh, how do I do this? I don't know. You can do a front flip, flip and do that sometimes. Um, so there's a bunch of neat abilities that comes with this game. Uh, the animations are fantastic. Uh, we should probably be going to the uh, freaking uh, target point of uh, operations. Dale? Yeah, I'll just go on ahead. There's different... Yeah, there's different sort of modes, but they all really just seem the same. It's practically just kill everyone. Um, if you're playing like solo or with a bunch of friends, you can play differently, um, depending if you like all have a certain class, like uh, what I what they call a Loki, which is practically just a stuff class sort of way. So there, uh, this game's completely free, though. Uh, just saying. Yeah, everything is free from what I can tell. Um, ah, oh, we just ditched one of our teammates. Well, he just had to wait. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, this game is completely free to play. It sort of has a Tribes Ascend sort of uh, system of payment where it takes a long time. Except it seems to be shorter than regular. Uh, this is hacking. You would have you pre you have to do this pretty often. Um, but it's not hard. Um, so, I'm just saying if this... I think the call just dropped. Uh, I'm just saying, if this game seems slightly interesting, you should probably get it. Extremely much more harder trying to play solo. Even if you're a much higher level. Oh god, it's the target. It's the target. It's the assassin. Help me up. Uh, help me up. Down. Uh, oh Jesus. Alex is calling us. That's what's, what's happening. Okay. Oh, the video's still going. Good. Whatever. Oh, I got it too. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna fix the frames. Um, if you see a slight problems, that's me. Um, this does use a good amount of frames, but if you have a good computer, it should be fine. 
Only if you're running that right now, you would have uh, slightly lower frames. Like, uh, I have to, I have get 20. That's what my average is. Yeah. Um, so if you look at the mini-map in the top left, the, the yellow exclamation mark is our objective. Oh, I leveled up. Um, they're separate level ups, so my character can level up individually, and his, each of his weapons can level up. Um, so that's the thing. There's also crafting, like uh, Far Cry, let's say. Just not as... Uh, it's usually just stuff that you pick off dead bodies. Okay, so we're, uh, up, uh, so yeah, uh, headshots also are worth more, uh, just saying, yeah. Okay, so I've been using my pistol mainly, uh, here, uh, pressing F, switch between my assault rifle and pistol, uh, you can do a basic slice, basic slash, which is practically just like a single bullet, or I can hold it and charge it, which practically kills many enemies and just kills them instantly. Other than certain enemies, which we'll see probably later in this video. So this one is probably going to be more like a let's look at video, as you can tell already. Okay, so uh, I have shield bars and uh, health bar. Health bar does not regenerate, uh, but shield bar does. Uh, oh, Jesus. Uh, you guys can handle that guy. Okay. As you can see, uh, there are mods for everything. For uh, each uh, class, sort of thing, which uh, for weapons and not for abilities, though. That's something. These are also crates where you find uh, new things. So there's two sort of uh, currency, I guess. I don't know if you'd really call it currency. Uh, if you uh, affinity is what they call experience, and credits is what they call money. Uh, those blue orbs there are uh, electric orbs. Uh, you need those to use these sort of abilities, right there. I'm coming through this hallway. I missed. Uh, yeah. Okay, so let me explain the mod slots, or the mods that we've been picking up throughout this game. Uh, you can uh, get like a pistol, let's say. And uh, you pick up a pistol mod, you would have to upgrade the pistol tree, like use it and level it up to unlock more slots, and unlock the, uh, a slot in the uh, pistol tree, which then you can add items and remove them. Uh, uh, you'll see more of that later in this video, most likely. I'm not even sure if I'm going to upload this, depending on it. Uh, so, there are different types of enemies. In the beginning, they're sort of linear. Um, a lot of this let's say, it is randomly generated in a way, Binding of Isaac style, let's say. Um, and uh, different game modes, uh, which are all involving co-op. Uh, I don't know where to go with this. You're not really contributing much. This is your video too, Tail! I know for a fact. Like, I can't... And... And I'm gonna fix my frames then. I'm actually gonna fix... I'm gonna fix my frames now. Hopefully. Hey, Martin. Uh-huh. Huh? Yeah, I'm just, uh... I just changed it about the sensing settings. I don't know. I'm getting 50 frames now on regular. Let's see with fraps. Fraps, yep, I have 30 frames now. Um, sorry if the game looks darker now. It's, uh, because of the settings I've turned off. I actually like it. This looks so much cooler. So, yeah. Uh, have you noticed animations here? How good they are? Uh, we both actually just picked up this game today. Uh, 
Yeah. Where the hell are you guys going? It's right here. So... Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I couldn't say. Okay, well, I guess I'll explain the control since I have the chance. Uh, double shift makes you roll. Uh, just for the people that are playing, pick this up. Holding shift and for running, and then tapping control like you do a leg slide. Uh, doing something else will make you do a uh, freaking uh, uh, jump front flip after that. And using your sword at the same time, which is E, will do that. And I'm getting another message. Oh, mission's complete. Uh, so here's the, it shows you, uh, your blueprints as well, which are meant for crafting. Uh, it shows you your ranking of your levels, uh, of each individual weapons and character. Uh, and, uh, the mods and the credits and stuff. Pivot break. Image. Yeah. Yeah, except for the damage part. But it counts, like, the shield damage as well. Okay, I'm going to show you the upgrading system. So this is what the skill tree would look like, and here's all our modifications that we would get. are all down here. Uh, uh, so my tree is pretty big. Uh, what should I get? What should I get? What should I get? I can either unlock a mod slot, which I sort of want to do. Um, get some more shield capacity, power, another mod slot. I'm actually going to get some shield capacity, just because mine are a little low. Uh, yes. Um, and they all have different sort of kill trees. There's a bunch of weapons in the shop. Uh, clip, fire rate. That's probably good. No, wait, damage, 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 damage. No, wait, I already have damage. Never mind. I'm being retarded. Yes, I do. Okay. And the sword, which is my favorite, and I hear that I can get super OP later on. I heard it from a little bird from the northern lion section of the world. Yeah. Wink, 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 wink. Okay, now I'm tell. Here's something you might know, which is very useful to get credits. Uh, if you go to your invent, if you go to arsenal and click inventory, you can sell the modifications you that you don't want. Yeah. Right. And it gives you a, pro a pretty good bundle of money if you uh, sell a bunch, which I usually do. Um, so you can get different Warframes, which uh, these guys are called. Uh, there is a story to this game. Everyone ignores it. Uh, it's something about like you're trying to take back stuff. Okay, let's look at the marketplace. We got bundles, which... Okay, so right here, that's platinum. Uh, that's money that you have to pay for. Um, they give you 50 right off the bat. Uh... But also, you can get these for, obviously, for free. Um, these ones, there are a few things that you have to pay money for. Um, like 75, like this guy, is worth 5 bucks. But, on the upside, I mean Loki, I can just buy Loki's blueprint and make him. Uh, blueprints blue, blue, are used, to cra in, used in crafting. I'll show you that as well. Um, so yeah, shops, burp, burp. catalyst right here. Uh, are also something that is needed to upgrade your character. Like, upgrade your uh, character tree. I'll just go to that really quickly, since I forgot to show that. Um, see? It shows... It extends a lot. But, uh, fret, because you don't actually need to pay, you can find blueprints for them uh, by doing alert missions. Do you know what those are? Oh, you were not listening at the beginning. Um, when they was telling you everything. Okay, um, right here, I'm uh, crafting a weapon in uh, the crafting system. It'll tell you what everything you need. What's Rush? 20 Platinum. Um, it'll tell you everything you need. Blueprints will show up here. I think the blueprints will disappear after you use it. Uh, so, yeah. Just saying. Um, they usually take a while. Like, this said 12 hours when I first started. Yeah. You probably have a blueprint as well. You should go check. Customization. Uh... Of, it's just really just the colors of your character. You don't got much here, but it's okay. Um, you can unlock the ch uh, color palette in the market, uh, but that's only the money. That's a little garbage, which I find, but whatever. 
Um, everything's much cheaper. Like in a few games, like say an hour, you can get ten thousand. Not selling any modifications or anything, which will probably give you another five thousand or so. So it's a it's a pretty good market. Um, again, this game is in beta. Like I found uh, a problem in the game where I could not play at all. Uh, yeah, we could not remember the door. Uh, the door not open, and it made us not complete the mission. So we had to quit out of that. Um, so here's is alert section. Uh, alerts are more like, hey, here's a boss, but it comes at random times, and you're more likely to get it the more missions you have. Uh, let's go online. Nope. I can't really show. Whatever, I'll just show the places I have. So this is the first planet. It's like starting at the closest to the sun to the farthest is the harder ones. Um, so we got Saturn here, which is another place. And it's uh, much bigger. And uh, there's three groups of enemies, I would say. Right, Tao? Okay. Yeah. I forgot everything I was going to say. No, I do not want to leave this session. Okay. Uh... Mercury, that's where I want to go. Okay, so um, I think Teo should explain rest of information. No, I didn't. No, you didn't. Oh, yeah, there's leaderboards. Let's show leaderboards. So uh, here you can see your stats just by clicking that up there. Or you can see your rankings. Teo, where are you anyways on your rankings? Forty-two thousand. Ah, okay. So yours is slightly lower than mine. I'm not gonna say so. It doesn't make you feel bad. Okay. So, <laughs> um, yeah, that's practically what it is. Uh, let's explain something else. Um, so where you see people like three and five here, I'm pretty sure that's how many either groups or individual people are on uh, each section. So if you want to play online and you want to play with some people, you might want to go to one of these places that have actual people. Like here, there is nobody playing that level at the moment. Um, for beta, it actually doesn't... It needs a bigger community, is what I think. It's not very well known. Uh, it, it's underground-ish, I guess. But it really doesn't, shouldn't be, because it's so good. Now, what? From him? What do you think? I don't know. How should I care? And I's just dropping the name like six times. Are we allowed to do that? Yeah, we are. Should we do that? Probably not. What? No, go screw yourself. Should we join Alex call? Is that a yes? Is this a yes? It'll maybe get interesting if we do. I'm joining Alex's call. 